this is it guys. Um, today is officially the last day I'm working for Amazon. I know I said I was gonna vlog it like my whole day, but I ended up racing uh, one of my co-workers, which I lost. <laughs> they beat me, she beat me. She's so fast, it's so crazy. But anyways, um, so I didn't really get to film anything besides like me delivering the last package and then this little part right here. But you know what, it's been real. Thank you for thank you Amazon. I hated you, but it was good. It was good while it lasted. Hopefully we can move on to something else. I already got offers from other companies, but we'll see if that's what I end up doing or if I just go like 360 on something else, you know. So we'll see. But hey, it's been real. This was my step band. I'm gonna miss you, step band. Um I'm gonna do like a little video with all of my past Amazon videos. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Hi, right, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm gonna take you guys along a typical day of work for me. So I started delivering for Amazon about, I think two weeks ago now. I've been doing this for, yeah, I think two weeks. And uh, I, I like it, it's actually pretty fun. I'm by myself the whole time and uh, I just deliver these packages. All these packages that you guys order, I'm out here delivering it for you guys. So you're welcome. It's the bike that I got. Oh, look at that. You guys can see like the bruise right there, right there on my arm. Yeah, that, that was from the dog. Um, besides that, everything else, it's been good. So we just got back to the warehouse. As you can see, this is where we enter and exit. Oh, uh, so it looks like I got stuck now. Um, the van doesn't want to go. He's, or maybe a little bit. Kinda, not really. I, I'm, I'm stuck. Uh, so, I guess I'm gonna have to call my, my boss and be like, Hey, so I got stuck. Uh, what do I do? <laughs> this is crazy. Oh my goodness. I'm usually, I was running from stop to stop to stop, you know, just to get done uh, during uh, some daylight still, because. I don't like delivering during night, it just, I don't know, I feel like, I don't know, just, I don't like delivering during night. Right here, these are the last ones, and then I already have like three up in the front, and I just put everything else back here, instead of putting it up in the front. And then I still got one oversized. Sorry on my second bag, uh, this is how the van looks like. I believe I got like 15 bags, all of the bags have packages, and then I got these bigger packages all the way back there. So we got a full van today, so it's gonna be so good today. And it's gonna be at an area that I, I've already delivered in. So that's gonna help so much too. Uh, it's such a big difference between peak season to today. It's like, it's mind blowing how many packages I was doing last week compared to what I'm doing now. Uh, like this job kind of ruined the feeling of seeing an Amazon package for me now. Like. Uh, each time that I just see an Amazon package, I'm like, that sucks for whoever had to deliver that. And I just, I'm thankful that it was not me. <laughs> we came to get some gas because I was like halfway into the tank. Let me show you how our van looks today. There she is. It doesn't look that bad. Um, just got over some oversizes. And then I think I got 13 bags. So it's not that bad. Um, I could have probably organized it better, but hey, it's gonna be a good day. Now, as you go to the back, this uh, this little door, you just light it to the side. Uh, you come to the back, this is how the Prime uh, vans look like. They got some shells, you can put them up, and then you can just keep them like that, right? They just stay like that. Uh, sometimes they just fall when I'm like turning, so they just stay down. Uh, same on this side, and same right here as well, a little shell, you know? Pretty cool. Anyways, um, so this is it. All these three packages are going to the same house. Let me go get the phone over there. I'm gonna just scan the packages right here uh, just so you guys can see how it's done. Uh, so there's basically this little barcode right there, right? That we just scanned with the device. And that's pretty much it. And then after that, we just follow the little arrow right there. And then it'll tell us exactly where we have to go. And I mean, we can see by the house number and everything too. But today was really easy, not gonna lie. It was probably one of the easiest days that I'll ever have. I had two boxes, so I went out. I, I was going to the house, you know, it had a little gate and I saw the dog. The dog was in the yard, you know? And um, I saw him, he saw me, 
And I always make sure that the dogs are like cool with me to go in, you know, because I don't want to get bitten. So the dog was cool with me, you know. He saw me get in and everything. And then he went over there, you know, he, he was minding his own business. And then I went, I dropped off the boxes at the front uh, door. And then I step back, I take the picture, I turn around. Next thing you know, that dog is right behind me, okay? And he's not waiting to get pet. No, 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 no. He was waiting to fight me, okay? So, what do I do? I don't do anything. I just, you know, I'm like, okay, just ignore it. You're gonna keep walking. I was walking, he started chasing me, you know? And he actually bit me. <laughs> he actually bit uh, my right leg thigh at the back on the hamstring. And man, it hurt, it hurt. Cause I honestly thought I was not gonna come back like after my whole accident because of my back. And I'm, this, I'm still recovering, oh my gosh, I'm so excited, I don't know why, but I'm still recovering of my back. So crazy, like I honestly thought that I was not gonna be back anytime soon, you know? To me, like what, well, I've been out from the hospital since January 18, so February 18, March 18, two months. I've only been out from the hospital two months. so we got our van um as you guys can see we have 114 stops with 222 packages and to be honest it's gonna be an easy day uh but for the first like 30 stops it's like all businesses which i mean you know it's it's whatever but then throughout the day it gets better i already saw on the map so driving the step vans you can drive with the doors open <laughs> so driving with the normal vans you know you have to open the door and close the door and to me that gets annoying you know and with the step van you can leave the doors open and you can just go in and out from it you know and i i find that so much more easier than having like to go in the van close the door and this and that you know it's just so much easier. We got all the DSPs just waiting. I heard that all the Amazon employees actually got to go home and they have us out here still waiting. We'll see how long this is gonna actually take. We have 400 packages, 401, uh, which is pretty crazy. This is like an all time high for me, uh, but we only have 183 stops. So I don't think it's gonna be that bad. Uh, this is how we looking. We got oversizes throughout the top shelves right here and then i have the bags right here this is the first bag and then it just goes straight down and then down to these bags down here and then to the other side so to be honest it's not gonna be that bad um i think i'm gonna finish like around six though so it's probably gonna take me a good while <laughs> but i'm gonna get it done before time is it worth it is it worth moving up to the step van you know uh or should you just stay driving the regular van my opinion is yes, it's worth it. I'm out here delivering for Amazon on Christmas Eve once again. Last year, I forgot how many packages I had last year, but last year I was uh, delivering in a rental van. This year I have the step van, man. It's been so much better since then, oh my gosh. Today I only have 149 uh, stops with 254 packages. That's the easiest it's been all season. I hate a van, I, it was more of a scratch. I'll show you guys a picture on the screen. Um, it was more of a scratch and it wasn't really my fault. That's how I see it and I don't think it should have, like, I don't know. I don't think they should have taken my sense of a way, but you know what, it is the way it is. On to the next chapter after that, so I'm pretty excited. I don't know, I'm very excited. We'll see what it brings. Uh, good things, bad things, we're gonna get through them all, so yeah. <laughs> Peace!